Hi guys, it's Nikki. So today I'm going to show you how to do the blood knot. Now this is a great knot for tying line to line. It could be mono to mono. It could be a mono to a leader. It could be braid to mono. Or it could be braid to braid. Now this is a great knot if you want to tie your main line to a leader line without a barrel swivel. Or if your spool is super low and you want to add more braid to braid or if you want to add more mono to mono, this is a great knot to know. So let me show you how it's done. Okay, so before I show you the mono to braid, I'm going to show it first on two pieces of string just to make it easier to see. So the yellow can be your mono and the black can be the braid. So let's get started. Now you want to take the tag end of your mono and the tag end of your braid and you want to lay them parallel, opposite directions, just like this. Now with the middle, you're going to twist the middle about five to six times. So that's one, two, three, four, five. So now that gap in the middle, you want to keep that gap open because these two tag ends I have in my hand, I'm going to send them through the middle of that opening. But when you send them through the middle, you want to make sure that you sit, put the tags in opposite directions. So I'm going to take the black braid one and put it through one way, hold it with my hand. I'm going to take the yellow one and send it through the opposite direction. So instead of going the same way the black one went, go in the opposite direction and then pull. So this is where if you have mono and braid, you moisten it up and then you pull both sides just like that. So now you're left with tag ends in the opposite direction. That's how you know you did it right. You see one goes one way, one goes the other way. You're going to take your clippers and clip those tag ends. Okay, so once you clipped, now you successfully have two lines tied together. This is called the blood knot. So let me show you this with braid to mono now. Okay, so let's go braid to mono now. I've got my nice Cast King Mega 8 bright zombie green braid to help show. So I'm taking my 10 pound mono and I'm going to use it as a leader line to my braid. So like I said, you want to take your two tag ends and you're going to lay them parallel to each other. Just like that. So now you want to take the middle and twist them. I'm going to twist it six times. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm leaving that gap open and the two tag ends. I'm going to take one and I'm going to go through the back way and hold it. I'm going to take my green braid and go the front way and hold it. So now this is where you want to moisten it. And then you simply just pull on both lines. So now you got a blood knot. So you want to clip the two tag ends. So now I can use this as a leader. I simply just clip and I have a nice smooth knot that's going to run through my guides and not get caught up. So this is the blood knot. 